Every year, an average household will send one tonne of rubbish to be disposed of by the local council. Regular use of a green cone or green johanna can reduce this amount by around 25%. The question is, which of the two is the most appropriate for your needs? The green cone, which is used for food waste only and needs a sunny area of the garden with good drainage, or the green johanna, which uses garden waste as well as food waste to produce a compost and is suited to a shady area. The Green Cone website will explain all you need to know in order to help you with your decision. The Green Cone comes in four parts along with a pack of hinges and screws. A green outer cone and lid, a black inner cone and digestion chamber which sits below the ground when assembled. Choose a sunny spot in the garden to site your Green Cone. It is also important that you choose an area with good drainage to allow the liquid produced to easily drain away. Dig a hole deep enough to allow the digestion chamber to sit below the ground. You can put small stones or gravel in the bottom of the hole to aid draining. Follow the six simple steps on how to assemble and install your green cone in the ground. When situating your green cone, think of how it might fit in with the landscape of your garden. If you have difficulty digging your hole or have poorly drained soil, consider creating a raised bed. The Green Cone Kitchen Caddy is used for collecting your food waste. Its sealed lid and filter prevent any unpleasant odours. How does your Green Cone work? Well, sunlight provides an energy source for the digestion process. The doubled wall solar cone creates a heat trap with warm air circulating, encouraging the growth of bacteria. Aerobic conditions in the digestion chamber reduce methane production. Natural microorganisms and worms pass freely in and out of the digestion chamber, aiding the breakdown of waste. A nutrient-rich liquid enters the soil, immediately surrounding the green cone. Your green cone will be delivered with an accelerator powder. By using this powder in the weeks after installation and in very cold weather, you will aid the natural digestion process. Dealing with your food waste is as simple as that. In contrast to the green cone, the green johanna is a hot composting container and should be situated in a shady area of the garden. Once assembled, the green johanna should be stood on soil or grass. The fully integrated base plate allows worms and other microorganisms to pass in and out. The best way to fill your johanna is in layers layers of garden waste and layers of food waste. The compost produced by the Green Johanna is a rich nutrient supplement for your garden. Flowers will grow and flourish and vegetables will taste better. All it takes to help reduce our dependence on landfill sites is the regular use of your chosen food waste digester. Whether you choose the Green Cone or the Green Johanna, managing your food waste will become a feature of family life. Together, we can make a difference. Thank you.